Hello, welcome back to the EFL Scarabet Championship for match day 20. Is we travel to uh, Sheffield United, the relegated side from the Premiership, of course, last season. And we obviously we came up from League Division 1. Well, we're coming on the back of a midweek win against at home against Plymouth Argyle, a good win, two goals to one. And then the game before that, we got a last minute draw. So we're coming on the back of a bit of form. So can the conti can that continue and get us up the league table? Well, the team we've gone for for tonight, we've got a bit more defensive against Sheffield United because they'll, they'll come at us. Um, we've got Will Volks and Josh McGeechin, and they'll be. Well, they'll be holding the fort at the back with Brown, Moore, Kyoso and um, Bennett. So let's get to the stadium uh, for the game against Sheffield United. Well, a good afternoon here from Bramall Lane for this game between Sheffield United and Oxford United. It's match day 20. We're coming up to the halfway mark of the season. And of course, Sheffield United will obviously want to bounce back into back into the Premiership. Well, Oxford United, as I said, come on the back of a good win in the midweek against Plymouth Argyle after going a goal down. So hopefully we can get something out of this game, which would be an absolute bonus. So Sheffield United get the game on the way. Red, red and white strikes back shorts. Ah, uh, Oxford today changed into their all white kit. That's a good ball over the top, but Jamie Cummins uh, just collects it. So it's Kyoso, uh, Elliot Moore back in the side this afternoon. Bennett had a rest a couple of games, so it's hopefully the resurgence uh, got his fitness levels back up with Bennett. The two Volks. Mikichin looking for Phillips on that right hand side. Oh, and it's a good ball by Phillips into the box, but. Oh, and it's a chance for Harris, but he's offside. Oh, a bit lazy there, the centre forward. Well offside. Got a bit more alert than that. But, oh, it's going to be a free kick to Sheffield United. Play the disappointment of last season for Sheffield United, obviously, but uh, hopefully they can get back into the Premiership. Well, anyway, Colby, the same up. Davis, ex Everton man, of course. And there's Saki. Oh, he's got past Edwards quite easily there. And uh, Davis, hey, Mark, with a shot. Good shave by Cummins. I think there was, wasn't much power in it, but uh, had to make the save. Come around, Bennett. Volks. Rodriguez back to McGeechin, Volks, and Bennett. Uh, he's got a bit of space to work in as Sheffield United are oh, actually playing quite deep as Edwards. Well, not much movement for Oxford as based inside to Volks. It's a bit crowded in that midfield area. Kioso now there, Phillips. Good ball out to Kyoso, but it's a bit too strong. Uh, it's a throw to Sheffield United. Aim up. He's obviously Conjure City player. X, but now he's here at Sheffield United. Kosoma again. Back to Robinson. Look to Burrows. Long ball up towards Brewster, but it's well cut out. Aim again. Rodriguez trying to track back. Davis. Saki. Well, well played. Ron Edwards just getting caught. Saki again. It's twisted and turning. He's got one to the far post, but that's any doubt. And now Phillips can get away. Got a bit of a break on. The ball to Kyoso. To Phillips again. And this time he's going to get past Robinson. Oh, he got a little bit of a. Oh, and it's, well, it's a poor shot by Harris. Suit up. Peter again. Who's up? Towards Brewster. Davis. Not plenty of bodies back at Oxford, but the 
trying to flare down this right hand side and Saki's got a ball. Ball in, Brewster, oh, he's over the bar. Oh, that was a terrific chance for the Sheffield player. That was a beautiful ball. Again, he's causing all sorts of trouble on this right hand side. And that should have been 1 0, but he's running it over. Now Cummins take this free kick. Goal kick, sorry. Brown. Bennett. As I say, we've got plenty of, plenty of room. But Sheffield United are running quite deep. Edwards. So it's got very crowded in that box, so it's going to be difficult to actually to break them down. Well, they've got to do it when they go down the... Well, the Coso's made the run down that right-hand side. Good ball in, Harris is there, but... Well, it's Edwards. Oh, it's over the top, but... Offside by Harris. That's just as a, a good couple of yards offside. Oh, so, oh, so good so far. It's uh, not been one of the ex most exciting games, but I always thought this one would be tough, especially. Anyway, Haymot, Davis, the ball, looks like he again. Need to get on top of him. One of these times he's going to get that. Oh, good covering. And it's gone. Oh, that's a good ball, but Harris will get this out. Now, Edwards. Now he's got a chance for a break. Play for Harris. Harris can get past Saki now, then he's got to get back there. Oh, and it's. Wow. Wasted. Saki. Davis. I suppose Don Buckingham will notice this combination down this right hand side of Saki and Davis is causing a few problems. Brown. Bennett. Again, Sheffield United are flooding that defensive area quite tightly. Heechin. Pioso. Phillips now. Phillips to get the ball into the box. Our Harris is there, but again he's offside. Well, he's not learnt his lesson as he's constantly again drifting himself offside. They can wag his finger, but he was definitely offside. Oh Davis too. Cut the free kick. Harris who top. On loan, of course, from Leicester City. Oh, okay, so now then, there's chance for Phillips. And, oh, McGeechin tried to get through, but Gus Amo was too strong. Suit up. Colourby. Sue's up. And Rodriguez coming across. Plays out to Davis. And it's Saki. Ooh, now he's taking the sprint on. Oh, and he's got a cross cross ball in, but Rodriguez up to Harris. Edwards, now Edwards, he's got a chance to get. Oh, he's trying to plead it through to Volks, who'd made a run, but it's well cut out. Here's Burrows. Ah, oh, it's a ball to Brewster. Brown should get this back to Cummings, he does. Nice touch by Brown, that could have gone anywhere. It's Kyoso. Rodriguez, Phillips, now then, he's got Todd. Oh, well, Phillips has won the ball back, good ball to Rodriguez. Shot, but it's just over the bar. Well, he saw the chance to have a shot and he obliged, but it's gone sailing over the bar. And that will be a goal kick to Sheffield United. So we're looking at the last couple of minutes before the half-time break and it's still goalless. Two top. Saki. Davis. 
Oh, it's coming out of position there to track him down. Oh, well played, Edwards. This time he's dispossessed the folk winger, but that's half time. It's Sheffield United nil, Oxford United nil. Not the best game, but it's an effective one for Oxford United. So it's Mark Harris to get the game back on the way for Oxford. It's goalless. And well, they did the South proud in that first half. I think they won a chance by Brewster from the header from the corner, but. Uh, well, there's Edwards. Puts inside, there's Volks. Feeching. Out to Phillips. Oh, McGeech's got down the line, but oh, he's been dispossessed by Robinson. They'll get back to his position. Davis. Shoot up. There's Robinson. That's long ball wide to Saki trying to find that winger again. Sousa's. Oh. Hounding him and pressing him down. There's Davis. Now Saki again. I bet it's been really busy this afternoon. Sousa. Out to Saki again. Davis, Aimer, oh well played, now then we've got a chance for a break here, McEachin gets on this right hand side to Phillips, Phillips is there and it cuts inside, has he got any runners, ah Mark Harris, oh and it's blocked, over the top, I have it's for the header but oh it's easy for Davis isn't it? Sheffield United goal. Well, a nice little break there. A couple of minutes for Oxford United. Let's see Don Brady come back in. As, looks like he's going to make a substitution. Colby. The Burrows. Phillips just checking back. Well played. Well played, Matty Phillips. Kyoso. There's Volks. Out to Bennett. That's chance for him to get forward. Edwards. Oh, he's got some pace. Oh, he's been brought down. Bennett, can he get one in? He, well, Davis is... Well, it's... Played an hour. Slipped. Ah, Bruce, and now they've got chance. Oh, they've got plays forward. He, out number in Oxford at the minute. There's Burroughs coming forward. Cullaby. Out to Hamer. Well played, Phillips. Uh, chance for McGeechin. Down the line to Harris. Kyoso. It's Phillips. No, it's McGeechin. Chance for Phillips. Oh, and Harris is there. Oh, and it's kind of gone in the box. It can't. Won't, just won't cry any for Oxford. Uh, Sheffield United to come away with it. 65 minutes gone. It's still no score. Colourby. There's a cross the park and well he's going round in circles. <laughs> Suit up. Susa again. Towards boost up. Oh and a Bennett. Now it's touched for Edwards to have that side. Ah and again he's Edwards gets one in the box, but it's cut out and easily for Sheffield United to come away with it. Saki again. Haymar. Nice long ball forward, but... Ooh, and it's come off Brown. Ooh, and Brewster. Ooh, that was... Uh, danger there for... I've got to be honest with you, I think the uh, defence of Oxford has been absolutely outstanding this afternoon. Out to Edwards. And it's a chance for... That's going to be a throw in to... Well, it's going to be a booking. I must have missed that. Saki must have been very early on. I'll have a look. Yes, it's way back then, weren't it? It's come 
Referee has come right back. So, triple substitution here by Don Buckingham as Edwards comes off. And Plachetta Don Sibley's on for Rodriguez. And Dane Scarlett's on for Mark Harris. So, let's see if that can change any fortunes. And, well, it just freshens the legs up a little bit. Oh, that's a good tackle by Cullaby. Good sliding tackle. More. Ah, oh, that's a good ball through to more. Brown's there. Oh, well covered back by Brown. Ah, cuts all that danger out. Kyoso. There's a chance for Phillips. Now then, can Phillips get one through to Sibley? He can. Crosses one. It's got to chase it. It's Phillips. A bit of pressure here for... Oh, it's picked over the top to Phillips. Now then, he's got a chance to get in the box. He can. Oh, and he's been cut out. Pioso. Oh, again, it's a poor cross. Cross has not been the favourite today for... Now there's a chance for Cullaby. This time, can... No, Moore's got past. Oh, again, Moore's done well. Oh, the defence has been... Well alert today, as uh, Phillips. This one down to Scarlett. Has he got a chance for Phillips to get into the box? No, it's just run past him. Oh, Tried to pitch one into Scarlett, but it's been cleared away. That's two minutes. We don't really want to chuck anything away today. Worked so hard and gets more. Oh, well played. Oops. It's, it's got stuck between the feet. There's Flachetta. In towards Volks. Keechin. Phillips. Oh, there's a chance he got the run by Sibley. Oh, but... Well, it's passing all over the place and it just ain't running right for Oxford. Now then, we've just got to defend a little bit more. Out to the far side here. Will it run out? It will. That'll go for the goal kick. To Oxford. Well, I've got Seamus off and Brooks is on. Sack Curtis is on for Saki, who's had quite a good game this afternoon. Been quite effective, but... At the end of the day. Kyoso. Begeechin. It's Volks. Partnership to Begeechin. The Volks has been quite uh, good this afternoon. Volks again to Begeechin. Phillips. Now oh, there's Phillips. He's in space. He's got a chance. He's going to the box. Oh, he's put it wide. <laughs> oh, there's the final. Sheffield United nil. Oxford United nil. We'll take a point here at Bramall Lane for sure. And oh, that's uh, yet a not, not another defeat, and that's the mountain. So, finishing goalless at uh, Bramall Lane, that's, I think that's a good point for us against a strong Sheffield United side. Well, then the rest of the results, Plymouth Argyle 1, Derby County 1, uh, Queen's Park Rangers 1, Preston North End 1, uh, West Brom shall be nil, Stoke City nil, runner draws there, and Leeds United have gone down to Luton Town by a goal to nil. Uh, Blackburn Rovers 1, Swansea City 3. On um, the page two, we got Cardiff City nil, Bristol City two. That's a bit of a blow to us. Uh, Middleborough two, Millwall two, Coventry City one, Sunderland one. All City nil, Sheffield Wednesday one, and um, Portsmouth nil, Watford two. So Portsmouth have lost. Uh, we're losing ground at the bottom of the league there. And Nor finally, Norwich City four, a uh, Burnley nil. So that's all uh, your this week's uh, results. Let's have a look at the league table. Ah, Watford are two points clear again of Sunderland with Burnley third, uh, Norwich City fourth, no, West Brom Javier fifth, and Leeds United sixth. They make up your playoff positions as uh, Middlesbrough just in on the same points as Leeds, but just down on goal difference there. So let's have a look at the bottom. And we are still in 23rd position because Coventry City now dropped down into the final relegation spot as Bristol City with their victory and Portsmouth well the six points adrift of Oxford now so well the, the what nine points clear of the relegations uh, 
in the relegation zone. So they looking a bit ominous for this season. Well, that's match day 20 out of the way. We'll go on to match day 21 as we entertain Norwich City down at the Kesham Stadium. So yet another, another odd game, but they're all odd games for Oxford in this league. We'll have a look at the schedule because we're getting up to the halfway stage. As you see, we play Norwich City at home. Then we travel to Burnley. And that's another difficult game against another relegated Premiership side. Our, our final game in this first half of the league, uh, we travel to top of the table, Watford. Well, uh, that could be a fine moment. Them, them next three games, Norwich at home. Uh, we've got Burnley away and we play Watford away. And then we start again for the second half of the a season so that is the fixtures and that is the uh let's have a look at the leaguing goal stores shall we see who is top our manager of west brom chairman's got 11 with anderson of queen's park rangers on 10 and there is player is mark harris on eight that's not a bad come return for our center forward ashley barnes there for norwich and we must have to look at him um bit of, is it bit Viponik, Viponik for Swansea has got nine. So our next player who's uh, in the, well, the next one will be Ruben Rodriguez on four. So there are your leading goal scorers. Uh, who's the assists? Have a look. Uh, Valo, Matty Phillips and Abby Owe, they're the ones who have got our top uh, marks for assisting for goals. So Bellingham for Sunderland is at the top. Well, there we go. That is match day 20 out of the way. As I say, we play Norwich City down at the Kesham Stadium for match day 21. So thank you very much for watching. Take care, and I'll catch you in the next one.